deposit or the withdrawal process, but like the options in which you can withdraw. So cryptocurrency, I mean, if you got a Coinbase account, this is gold. You know what I'm saying? Wherever Ripple, Litecoin, Ripple's XRP for guys that don't know that, and that's one of my, one of my favorite coins actually. I'm actually gonna deposit that in the in the Ripple. I didn't even know you could do that. But guys, I want you fair warning right here. Again, if you have made a deposit within seven days, you won't be able to cash out. If you wagered any free play money, which I believe I did, just to get them out of there, you, you know, you may be able to cash out. I may not be able to cash out right now. So if it doesn't happen, it doesn't happen, guys. But this is where you basically go when you when you basically go to cashier as opposed to depositing, go withdraw. It's gonna give you the Bitcoin options. It's gonna give you the bank wire options. The I don't are, there, are they still doing MoneyGram? They, like MoneyGram was was a thing for me back in the day. But as you see, the maxes are are, are different. So what are you? This is are you guys seeing why? You just, just, you just look at right there. You see how cryptocurrency is the best way of doing it because, like, you can you can do a minimum withdrawal of 20 bucks, a max of 25k for all of them. Money orders, it has to be a minimum of $500 with a $50 processing fee. It sucks. A, like, ACN, so it hits your account. It's a, it's a $20 plus a 2.5% processing fee. It takes five days for it to hit your account. Which is not bad. A lot of a lot of fintech companies, a, a, a lot of companies take four to three to five business days. So that's not bad. But the max you can do is a thousand. You know what I'm saying? And or, well, that's with, with the a, ACH minimum is 100. If you would do a straight bank wire, it would take two weeks. But you can wire up to twenty five thousand dollars straight to your bank if you's about that life. Minimum is five hundred. But you all got fifteen days to wait for that. I don't check by courier. That's too much. MoneyGram taking five days. That that's um that's about accurate right there. But obviously, as you guys are making bigger wages and all that stuff. And again, mind you, this may not work right now because this is how it is. But I would go with the cryptocurrency ways of depositing and withdrawing because the minimums are the lowest, the maximums are the highest. There's no processing fee. It's free for all cryptocurrencies. It's, it's no brainer right there. I like Ripple. Let's see if Ripple works for you, boy. Okay. Click on that. Yeah, exactly. So I understand why this was because it says no existing free play balances or free play pending wages. And I believe I do have a free play pending wage. So that's going to happen, guys. Just putting that out there. So let me, let, let's, you know, we'll, we'll do another wrap of this right here. I actually do a the deposit into the account. But also a withdrawal to the account. But I just wanted to show you guys this options. I had a feeling it wouldn't let me withdraw because I, I recently had free play, and you know you gotta basically have zero free play in wages, in winnings, or 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 with or withholding. Basically having free play money available to play, or having it within wages, or having it within winnings, um, will let will, will block uh withdrawal. Okay, so free play. It's, a, it's not a bad thing, but it can basically, um, you know, if you're trying to deposit or withdraw, sorry, for, trying to withdraw, then, you know, obviously free play, you don't want to sign up and use free play. Because if, if you if you pay that, if you wager that amount, because you're going to have to wager that amount in order to withdraw anyway. You're going to have to wait seven days, but if you wager that amount and if it wins, it's going to come down to a times 10 payout, so... That's two thousand dollars that you would have to wager at least. It's either times ten or times nine. It's it's but it's definitely times ten for sure. So it's just like I would say. There you there you have it, guys. Just just you know stay stay steady. If you got some if you got some winnings and, and if you and you need to cash out if you know that you got to cash out for a certain thing, then the best thing we can do is obviously no free play will help with that. But you got to um, plan seven days in advance, seven business days in advance. Okay, or even two weeks in advance. If if you got some like you got, let's say for example, you got rent coming up. <laughs> if you got rent coming up, then what's the, what's the date? Today would be a good day to um to basically possibly make a wager with no free play, deposit in, and then you should be able to cash out by the first. But again, it could take twenty four to forty eight hours via Bitcoin, as you're seeing right there. 
You know, Bitcoin's the only one right now with, with the with the twenty four hour turnaround time. So this is like you know, say Bitcoin would be your best route if you were depositing today, so you can make so so, so you could um pay your rent on the first. Bitcoin would be your best option because you could be able to deposit in seven days, no no free play, and then by the thirty uh, September thirty first, I don't know if it's the last day of September or something like that, but by the first, by the first of Telling you by the first of October, that money would be in your Bitcoin account. Okay, if not by the first, then by the third. But your rent money would be there from your winnings, so you can keep your earned base income, your hard earned money, keep that in your pocket, keep it safe. You know, let that cash flow pay for your expenses, the liabilities in our lives, man. Because that income has the least, um, you know, it's the it's it's the least taxed and it's it's not even capped, so. And you, I mean, in regardless of what vehicle it is, fuck how it acts. It's as long as it stacks up. It's all mathematics, guys. So talk to you all soon. Don't forget to hashtag Game Six.